This is the third part of the tutorial on how to solve the fused cube. Now, as you just learned, for the half cross, the three corner pieces to complete your first layer, and then your three F2L pieces to finish your first two layers, now you are moving on to the top side, or the last layer. Now, you are going to be using the equivalent of two look OLL on this, which is which means you will learn a few algorithms, two to be precise, on 2-look OLL, which is used in the Friedrich method of the normal 3x3 solve. So, you can have four different cases on the top. You can have the dot, you can have the line, you can have a small l, and you can have a whole cross. If you have the whole cross, you can just move on to the next step. And if you don't, I will show you the algorithms you need to know now. This is the exact same as the beginner's method, with a slight tweak to one of them. So you should be able to easily get this if you can solve the 3x3 cube. If you have the dot, what you want to do is F R U R prime U prime twice. R U R prime U prime, then F prime. Now you'll have the line, turn it horizontal, do F, R, U, R prime, U prime, F prime. That will get you to the top cross. If you have the small L, position it in the top left, and do F, then R, U, R prime, U prime twice. R, U, R prime, U prime, F prime. And that will get you to here. And the last case, which I need to show you, is the line. Horizontal line. This is the easiest case to solve from. You want to position it horizontally and do F R U R prime U prime F prime. That will get you your top cross. And now I will talk I will tell you how to do the OLL, which means you get all of the same color on the top. Now I only have two corners up in this one, and I also will have two corners up in this one. So what you want to do is you'll be learning two algorithms, the soon algorithm and the anti-soon algorithm. You want to position, turn the top layer so that yellow on one of the corners is facing the front, and do the soon algorithm, which is R, U, R prime, U, R, U2, R prime. Now you should have, and you will need to do that until you get to a case where three corners only are flipped up. In this case, this is the anti-soon, because when I position a corner here, yellow is always on the right, no matter how I turn it. So you want to position it so it's like this, with the back one on the left, and then these two on the front, and you want to do the anti-soon algorithm. R, U2, R prime, U prime, R, U prime, R prime. That will get you the OLL on that cube. On this cube, it happens to have the same uh, setup as last time, so I'll mess it up a little bit to get us to a different one. Okay, here. This is the one odd case that cannot be solved by positioning the top color in the front. If you were to do that, and you do soon, R, U, R prime, U, R, U2, R prime, you just get back to it again. And that, as you can tell, would be an endless loop. You'd never get out of that. So what you want to do is position these two on the left side, if you have this case, and do the anti-soon algorithm. R, U2, R prime, U prime, R, U, R prime. And that will get you to this case. Now you want to do, position it in the front, R, U, R prime, U, R, U2, R prime, which is the soon algorithm. Position it white in the front again, and do the same algorithm. R, U, R prime, U, R, U, 2, R prime. And now, again, you've gotten to the anti-soon case. R, U, 2, R prime, U prime, R, U, R prime. Now you've done OLL. Now, how will you know if the final case you have is soon? This is the soon algorithm, where white is always on the front. If white is always on the front of the front right corner right here, you want to position the two unsolved in the back and one in the front and do the normal soon algorithm. R, U, R prime, U, R, U2, R prime. Now we'll get you OLL on both cubes. 
Now, if you will please click the link at the bottom of the screen or in the description to your right, you'll be taken to the fourth and final part of this tutorial, which is the PLL step on each cube.